Hi, good morning. Uh, this is your friend Han here, and it is great to see you here this morning. And if you watched the interview last night, you know today it's about a fantastic product. It's called the Keyword Organizer. So yeah, you, you know you got a Google Keyword Tools, you got a Marker Summarize, and a, you know a Keyword Scout, Keyword XP, whatever your favorite keyword tool searching tool is, right? Uh, they are doing a fantastic job for grabbing the keywords, um, uh, scraping a whole bunch of bunch of keywords, sometimes hundreds, sometimes thousands, sometimes ten thousand. And you name it right and so so you got a pile of keywords what are you gonna do now I mean are you gonna manually look into them and it's gonna take you freaking five years to do that right so uh, in the past we were using Excel sheet we trying to search you know filter by search volumes so we're gonna try to search it by category names whatever we do it, it's just still a very time-consuming process and then we have to take this uh, keyword somehow organize it into article and review format. It's just a lot of pain, right? And it's a lot of uh, it's a very, very time consuming um, project. So if you are giving to your VA, uh, it might cost you a lot of money. Let them do it as well. So uh, until now, uh, we had no other alternative uh, alternative choice. But this is a, I'm gonna say this is the solution to that huge problem. It's gonna make your workflow a lot more effective so you're gonna focus on the money produce activity uh, instead of uh, uh, you know spend way too much time into research and organize your keywords okay so this is really really gonna simplify a lot uh, your life uh, when it comes to organized keywords you're gonna absolutely love this okay so uh, if you're in a hurry make sure you're coming back here uh, around 11 a.m. Uh, even um, some you might even want to check it out it might be open now okay depends on what time you open this uh, watching this so uh, um, clean your cookies, clean your cookies, and grab from the link below, and uh, so I can send you all 49 bonuses. Okay, it's gonna be absolutely fantastic bonuses for you guys. Anyway, so uh, without further ado, uh, in in case you missed the, you want to check out the sales page before launch. Here it is. You want to check out the interview you missed last night. Here it is again and uh, now all that great stuff so just click on the here's the interview and here's the sales page I put up a very comprehensive uh, demo up here as well for you and uh, so without further ado let's kind of take a quick look what this thing looks like okay so after your you you make the purchase you probably gonna come to a similar page you look like this. I can't promise you're gonna come to the same page I'm looking at but that's the only thing I have right now uh, so you're gonna click and, and, and download it to your Windows desktop and, and uh, uh, then you you gonna activate with the, your email address, um, so you turn to a trial offer into a real um, program, a software, and uh, <clears throat> and then he he has including a quick walkthrough, which is kind of old. It's still using the old Google Keyword tool. It's no longer really there anymore. Uh, but then here's another very comprehensive training, which is. Uh, using the new Google keyword too, so he he walked to the exactly way how you should use it and all that stuff. I found this one the uh, more useful. I uh, just want to quickly point out, I probably won't have much time to talk about this. This is actually the OTO. Uh, this one is not just on the Windows only, but it's also uh, Mac Mac too. Okay, it works on Mac, iMac, whatever. Or, or you know Mac version so this one's actually pretty cool I have a few minutes I will demonstrate this but this is actually uh, grabbing the keywords for you and it's very very unique okay so how do you use this uh, keyword organizer let's back to the main product here okay so um, what you do is you go to the new Google keyword planner AdWord, whatever you call it right so you, you, you type a seat keywords here so you're gonna obviously come up with a whole bunch of results, right? So um, one thing you need to want make sure is you want to go preference. Um, this thing has to be set to English, okay? Or else the software might not read um, display language. It has to set to English, uh, or else the software might not able to function correctly, okay? And that, why I don't know. It just it, he just said that in the training video, so I want to point that out. So what you want to do is you just you know get a C keywords, file loss or something, and you get idea. Bing bang boom, it's here. And what you want to do is you want to click download. Um, you hit a download and you download to a CSV file, and uh, 
So I already done that. So CSV WAP file. Once it's a download, let's open this. To save time, I already import it to here. Um, but uh, um, what you need to do is you go to import and export. Just import and wherever you save that file, um, you just grab it. Okay, grab the file and drag into this blue arrow here, and you will automatically import for you. And, uh, and you cannot import into the gray list. Okay, so let me explain what this white, gray, and black means. Okay, why means that I'm definitely going to use this keyword. Um, gray means I haven't decided yet. Black means it's a blacklist. It means I, I don't want to use this keywords. Okay, so so to send to gray, send to black, you just right click on it. So you're gonna send to it. You can, you can do whole lot, you know, everything together, or you can do individually, or you can select a couple at the same time. You know, you can just kind of you can see you can just quickly sort through this, right? And also, uh, let me see if I can uh, shrink. Let me let me let me shrink this far very quick, okay. Also, you do want to have the go to column settings. Uh, the green ones is the one that works with the new um, Google Planner now because, you know, they took a whole bunch other information off. So there's not much, uh, you know, you can do about. So the green ones is the one that that's what's left. Okay. So you want to check all those and don't worry about it. There's, don't worry about it. there's full training on this. So the right number will show up okay so let's say I want a monthly uh, average monthly search to be of uh, above 1,000 so you just type in there now on all the keywords you only down to this many now now I want to take this thing um, um, obviously this one's into an article so let's just kind of hey I, I want to take the best diet and best diet best way loss diet uh, oh, maybe just also um let's just say let's not not put this filter on let's say i want to search for certain keywords all you have to do is put the more diet you will highlight them for you okay all right so there's a couple of filter options uh let's say you want a cpc value over two dollar and just type it in there bing bam boom it's there okay so once you've done that then you have to organize it right so that maybe this is other keywords I want to focus on first because you got a search volume. It's got the, you know, whatever <clears throat> the, uh, the the CPC on my range. So let's actually put a, a thousand here. All right. So um, so um, I'm gonna start a, a a new article. Let's let I'm gonna just kind of like start with a new one. Okay. So just kind of walk you guys through this. Uh, so we're gonna have to first add a category because um, you know if you look at the WordPress site you have to put an article into the category right so let's just call the best diet category okay um, it just happened to be the same keywords and then uh, we're gonna add article within the category so uh, um, I don't know best diet to maybe what is the best diet to lose weight so that's this is the article part. This is where you can uh, actually, you know, creating the article reviews. So uh, let's just say, hey, I want this keyword in there. I want that keyword in there. Um, by the way, you gotta have to enlarge it. I want that keyword in there, and I want that keyword in there. Okay. So, <clears throat> so for your, for your convenience, uh, it, it give you the average search results in here. Um, uh, average search results in here as well and he also tells you hey is your keywords in the title uh, is your keywords uh, phrase also found in the uh, article sluggish which is here um, is in the content it's not in the content because I have no content here so maybe I just what is the best diet to lose weight do you know that so as I type, it tracks it too. So now it's in the content. So green is good. Uh, this is partially some of the keywords is in there. Okay. So best weight loss diet. So if you type there, the content is green, uh, but the title and, and and slug doesn't have the keyword in there. So you kind of just quickly know what that is, and then uh, once you've done your content creation in here. Uh, you're just gonna export it to an 
uh, CSV file for WordPress and you upload you're done okay this is actually a full HTML editor here uh, you can do whatever and this is what it looks like uh, this is the where you you type it in and this is the instant like preview sort of window so uh, you know you can shrink this if you want more room uh, this window actually expand horizontally and vertically as you want as you can see so I'm recording this, I'm kind of limited to this little frame or window here. So just to let you know that negative keywords, keyword tags is all in there, okay? So what happened when you put the negative keywords inside the list, uh, you know, anything, any new that, any new keyword idea you input in here uh, will, no, will no longer be showing. Oh. See that part, that middle part can disappear and appear by clicking the plus button. Okay. To me, it's probably too long. Yeah, this is good. All right. So this in a nutshell, this is what it is. And I think you guys see the whole idea here that it's it's much easier to organize this way uh, than the other way because you know you know you have ten thousands, twenty thousand freaking keywords here. You, you you just don't know what category to put under what article they're going to and this is also a great way to train your VA to write articles as well hey this is the keywords uh, it, it, it also checks if that keywords being included in the article or not right so uh, this is for the price uh, for what it does this is awesome <laughs> so I wish I had this when I started with internet marketing to make my life so much easier and also um, by looking at if you don't want to use any of the content creation part it's also really good filters to look at what Questions people are asking, uh, you know, if you product creator, all that stuff. Okay, so this is also a great way to show you offline clients. Um, this are the things people are looking for in a very organized and nice format, right? So anyway, so there's a lot of different ways to use this. Got to use your creative mind a little bit here. Okay, all right. So uh, uh, I only have a few minutes left, so I'm gonna kind of quickly show you the uh, keyword too. Okay, which is the OTO, and this is totally optional, but I think it's cool. And here's why. Um, it has all this thing. Uh, Wildcat, Wildcat is the one that actually search with the keywords. Um, you looking for the questions. You know, when you're trying to get to the camera, and you're, you're looking for the question, what people are really asking life in in the uh, in, in in inside of Google as of right now. And how to this is the money keywords. Okay, for so this is a great way. Um, to uh, shopping, you know, five thousand, one thousand. You want to, if you want to get some uh, keyword idea, if you want to brainstorming market marketing idea, this is a great tool, man. This is like best of camera for. So you come up with this huge, huge, huge list, like how to make iPhone, how to make frame, how to e make email, all that great stuff. So just you know, uh, a massive, massive list, very, very quick too. Okay. So you just take actually, yeah. So you just type the keywords in here, and also uh, for the, for my video friends, and there's um, a keyword scraping tool for YouTube, Amazon, all that stuff. It's also in here too. Okay. So I didn't have much time to watch the uh, a, a tutorial for this yet, but this is a very very awesome. Like, if you want to create videos, you want to create articles you want to get some idea of what title to use what content to write uh, this this is a great research tool I can tell you that all right so it's very very fast too as well and plus this one work with the Mac a plus in my shoes anyway so uh, this is your friend hand and if you do believe uh, this thing's gonna really shorten your time doing your keyword research and help you organize everything in, in a very nicely manner uh, go grab this on launching time and I think you're really gonna like it uh, make sure you're clean your cookie grab from the link below so you can get all 49 bonuses below you can just scroll it down on this page and check it out all right until next time this is your friend hand keep smiling and uh, I'll be talking to you soon cheers